We're trying to replicate reality here. There's so many things that the current technology does not do. You know, there's a shift in culture where I think the idea of immersion um, has gained more traction. There's still a lot of limitations. What we ultimately want is CG content mixed with captured content in a convincing, real way that doesn't cost you $5 million. Creatively, we're going through the exercise of making a lot of VR, both with video and CG, and we're finding all the pain points. Camera systems is a pain point, post-production is a pain point, distribution and playback is a pain point. You need the ability to move around in the world and you need the ability to interact in the world. Six degrees of freedom in a live action environment that felt photorealistic would be the next step. Presence is definitely one of the key points of VR as a medium. If you can move in the space, you know, the limit is the stars. With Lytra Emerge, we took the approach of going back to first principles and thinking about what do immersive storytellers want in terms of an end-to-end -end system to be able to create professional-level content for virtual reality. At a conceptual level, we're building a capture system, and the way to think about it is imagine you have the spherical surface, right? And every ray of light coming from the outside world is captured and recorded. And what we're recording is two pieces of information. First, where that ray of light hits a surface, and second, the direction that light's traveling. If you can capture everything intersecting the surface, you've actually captured all the light from the outside world that would have passed through that volume. So you really have every ray of light within the whole volume. We collect enough ray data that we're able to recreate a model of the scene that's being viewed. And that recreation is not just what color are things in different directions, but actually how far away is each thing along each ray. As users move in the six degree of freedom experience, then we redo that computation at a kind of theoretical or conceptual level. And that's how we deliver an experience that's truly immersive. Lytra Emerge consists of a radical new camera design that for the first time in history captures the full light field volume and gives consumers a six degree of freedom experience within that. It, it includes the Lytra Emerge server, which gives you all the storage and all the processing that you need in order to capture and manage all that data. We've built a set of light field editing tools that integrate with all of the industry leading editing solutions, including things like Nuke, so that immersive storytellers can work in the environment that they're used to, but bring to bear all the power of the light field. Uh, and then finally, we have the Lytro Emerge Player, which lets you take all of this incredible light field content and play it back on all of the leading virtual reality headsets and systems that exist today, and many more that are coming in the near future. Lytro Emerge is a true light field volume solution, which means we're not just stitching together the images that are captured. Instead, we're essentially rebuilding a version of the scene. As a result, we have very highly reliable depth information, and that makes it possible in subsequent processing to merge computer-generated imagery with the imagery that's captured by the rig. To reassemble this amount of data and be able to view it from different vantage points in different directions requires that we have that depth data. But once we have it, it also has other applications. Being immersed in it, playing a game, having the scene that's happening react to what you're doing is going to make a huge difference. It's really exciting.